everybody and welcome back to my kitchen. I hope you brought your sweet tooth with you because today we're going to be making caramel corn, vegan caramel corn. So, so delicious. If you're new to this channel and you want to see more super easy vegan recipes as well as other holistic tips, make sure you subscribe. We'd love to have you be a part of the community. Be sure to hit that bell button so you're alerted for all of our multiple weekly videos. If you find this video helpful, give it a like and give it a share. Now I have a question for you guys. Do you remember those popcorn tins from growing up? I know they still have them, but I remember them from growing up. It had like the caramel corn, the cheddar, and the regular. If you remember those popcorn tins, comment below popcorn tins. I don't know how many people remember those or still have those in their life. I definitely remember them. I would always eat just multiple little sections of them. <laughs> I know that for me, I don't always want something sweet. So make sure you stick around to the end of this video because I'm gonna share with you a very, very simple way to season your popcorn when you're in the mood for something savory. We all know I'm like really uptight about all the ingredients that I use. So this is the vegan butter that I use. There's only a few that I'm willing to use because vegan doesn't just vegan doesn't mean healthy. So you gotta flip that around and read the ingredients. So many store bought vegan butters are not good for you. Love that one. Minimal ingredients, organic, it's wonderful. And you're gonna need some type of pan. I have this big old guy, this pan right here. You can use a casserole dish, anything that is gonna be a little bit bigger and wider. Parchment paper on the inside. And again, below will be the full instructions and ingredients and products that I use as always. So let's go ahead and get started. In a pot, I'm gonna put a little bit of coconut oil, let that melt, and this is where I'm gonna cook my popcorn. You can also use microwave popcorn if you'd like, but I don't use microwaves, so I always pop my own popcorn. I'm just gonna put the kernels here into the oil, make sure that they're coated really well just so it's right above the kernels a little bit. You can kind of see right here. Just so they're coated, you don't want to drown them in there. You're gonna cover it up and just turn it on high, medium high to high. Remember kind of the jiffy pop? Once it starts popping, I give it a little shake. That way none of them burn or stick to the bottom. Once you don't hear any more popping, all the kernels are ready to go. Go ahead and pour it in your pan that you're gonna be using lined with parchment paper. And we're just gonna set this aside for later. Let's make the caramel. We're gonna put our butter, our sh brown sugar, our salt, a couple other ingredients. Everything's gonna be listed below in detail, so make sure to check that out. Slowly melt this on low. You don't want your sugar to burn. Don't walk away from it. Don't blink for too long. Just pay attention to this. Keep stirring it. Once it's pretty melted, I turn the heat up just a little bit, and again, you keep stirring it. Continue to stir. It's gonna start bubbling. You see these bubbles here? Just boiling lightly. Let it boil lightly like this, stirring for a few minutes, and then immediately pour it over your popcorn. Immediately. You need to do this right away, that way it's still hot, and once you mix it all up in your popcorn, it spreads well. Even if it doesn't spread too well, you're going to put this in the oven and you're going to mix it a few times so it'll continue to spread around. We're going to check on this just a few times and give it a good stir. And popcorn time. All right, well that's it. Caramel corn, it's not gonna last too long at all. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and comment below. Let me know if you have any questions. Let me know if you try this out. As promised, if you're not in the mood for something sweet and you want a little bit more savory flavor on your popcorn, I got you covered. 
very very easy you're going to sprinkle a little bit of nutritional yeast my favorite is the black garlic nutritional yeast there's regular and then there's also a turmeric one i really like the turmeric one on popcorn because it has a very nice orange color so it kind of mimics that cheddar powder that I was used to growing up but any type of nutritional yeast is delicious it gives a cheesy type flavor a little bit of salt and I then I sprinkle a little bit of garlic powder that's it and dig in very very gently toss it and put a little bit more taste it everything go by taste taste it add a little more taste it and make it exactly how you like it. Thank you so much for being here, you guys. Question of the day is those popcorn tins that have the regular popcorn, the cheddar, and the caramel, which one was your favorite side? I dug right into that cheddar side and I always left the rest. <laughs> My family would open it up and there would only be the two sections left. Every single one, the cheddar was gone. What section did you dig into or did you like them all? Comment below, let me know. Make sure to subscribe, hit that bell button, like this video if you found it helpful, and share it. See you next time.